welcome to BRI's weekly market updates. I am Ajima Kebaba today, Lawal, and I'm going to run you through last week's market performance. But first off, Otedola's new company, Gerego Power PLC, led the top gainers back to back on two consecutive trading days, Wednesday and Thursday. The company got listed on Wednesday and pumped in 2.5 billion naira shares into the Nigerian economy. The company has also made record by becoming the first power company to be listed on the NGX website. The week today's performance indicates the banking index as the top loser as it declined by 337 basis points, followed by the insurance index which declined by 112 basis points and the oil and gas index which declined by 102 basis points. The week today's performance indicates the banking index as the top loser declining by 337 basis points, followed by the insurance which declined by 116 basis points and the oil and gas will decline by 102 basis points. Also, the consumer goods index declined by 56 basis points and the insurance goods index declined by 33 basis points. Furthermore, the local bus closed at 43,351.43 points as the yesterday return of the market gained 10.9% or 1,090 basis points. Top gainers for last week's trading session were led by F10 Coco, Innsbrill and Sovereign. On the other hand, top losers were led by May Baker, Nascon, and Academy. For trading activity, the total value traded and the volume traded declined by 2.4% and 31.9% to close at 137.2 million units and 1.7 billion naira, respectively. GTCO, Oando, and Transcorp led the value traded with 33.7 million units, 18.4 million units, and 13.5 million units, respectively. On the other hand, GTCO, Zeni Bank and MCN led the value traded with 573.8, 334.8 and 144.6 billion naira respectively. That's it for VRIU's weekly market updates. My name is Ajimoke Babatu Lawal and for more information, please visit www.businessd.ng.